Welcome to The Boiling Point. I'm Richie Ware. This is Steven Taylor. Now, sometimes you get out into the boneyard and you kind of uncover things that you, you need to talk about. And so came across the uh, this, this valve and then all of a sudden you got this pipe sticking out of it. And so it's a steam warm up valve, um, obviously, um, that's on this particular valve, uh, gate valve, correct? Yep. correct. And um, so anyway, like to know a little bit about what the heck this thing is for. Uh, the steam warm-up valve is just what it call, what, it's, what, it's, what it says. The downstream side, it's, you get this shut off, you've been working on the steam line down, downstream for whatever reason, and you're ready to open this valve back up and put steam into it. Well, that's a pretty good sized valve, and a lot of times these are big high pressure valves. You don't want to open that gate valve and just dump steam into it. The mm. water hammer will take steam lines out. It makes all kinds of problems. So you get around that, you just open this valve up, let steam bleed into it slowly, heat that line up slow, then you can get the, the let that steam condense, drain the condensation out of that line, and takes all of that out of it. That's the primary purpose of that, is, is to warm that line up and make it, make it easy, and, and to, to keep you from having that water hammer and get all this condensate of that line. That's the primary use for it. Yeah, that's pretty cool. That, that, there's a, obviously a lot of pressure that's coming here. Yeah, that's the secondary use for it. Most of your technicians in the field they're not as concerned about warming the line up as they are about opening that valve up. Yeah. Because if you've got, if you're a 300 pound system, 600 pound system, that's a lot of pressure on that gate. It makes it real hard to open that valve up. Right. If you equalize this, get the same pressure on this side as that side, makes it really easy to open up. Uh, then you don't have to worry about cracking that valve and going real slow so you don't get too much steam in there because the pipes go to shaking and carrying on. It's all heated up, equalized, makes it real simple very safe operation with an equalizing line. I always um, think about who thought of this? You know, I mean, just out there just thinking, well, what if we just did put this line here and did this and, you know, yeah. make things well, simple. And most of them that you see are not in the valve itself. They're actually in the line itself. They're running a two inch line or one inch line around the valve right, and right. hook them in. Right. This one is a pretty special valve. It's built into the valve itself, which makes it really simple. Very right, cool. Well, appreciate you hanging out in our bone yard out here, and um, we'll see you next time on The Boiling Point. Appreciate Steven talking about the steam warm-up valve. Now, the interesting thing about that is that topic, the steam warm-up valve, came from one of you out there, and we always appreciate you comment, commenting, and we want to be a resource for you, so make sure you're commenting on our videos, and we'll be sure to try to answer and maybe even feature uh, something that you come up with, some type of topic. So. Also, go out and make sure you uh, check out Brent and with the Steam Cultures and all of our other videos on our YouTube channel. Well, like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter. If you don't mind, subscribe to the YouTube channel. And as always, if you like the videos, please share them. And we'll see you next time on The Boiling Point.